The two things you need to do if you have a gun with a traditional external safety is number one, you need to train with that safety. Meaning when you're dry firing or you're at the range and you're practicing drawing from a holster, part of that maneuver has to be disengaging that safety. So whether it's one movement depends on your gun and your holster. It could be one fluid movement. You uh, grab the gun and as you're pulling it out of the holster, you disengage that safety. Or it might have to be two separate movements depending on your gun and your holster type. Whatever the case may be, you need to train disengaging that safety when you take the gun out of the holster so it's ready to use. The second thing you have to do if you have a traditional safety is not depend on it. Don't rely on it. It's mechanical and it can fail. It's your concealed carry tip of the week, folks. Take care. Stay safe and thanks for watching.